Hi, this is Jamie from Master Dots. This is an Elementor add-on plugin. It has a lot of free elements and extensions which are enough to create an awesome website. As it's a freemium plugin, you can download it from the WordPress plugin repo. If you want to get the pro version, then check the pricing page from our official website. Link is given below for both free and pro versions. In this video, I am going to talk about tooltip. So let's drag this element tooltip element. And you will see this type of icon and when you hover on this icon, you will see some content. This is the default look and of course you need to customize it on your way. I am going to show you how you can customize this uh, tooltip uh, element in different style, different position with text or image. So first of all, let me show you the content setting. From content setting, you can select icon, text and image. By default, you will see the icon and when you click on icon library, you will see all found awesome five icons and you can select any one from this list. Now let me select a MailChimp icon and you can see this icon applied here. Now if I need a text, just click on text, hover me and customize the text on your needs. Then hover here and you will see that tooltip then image just select your desired image and insert and you can see the image and when i hover you can see the tooltip you can show the link and when you show the link you can place any link on for this now navigate to tooltip options from tooltip options you can define the tooltip text here you can see these are some dummy tooltip contents. Uh, you can change the content and then you can change the direction. By default, you can see the tooltip on right side of image. Let's make it on bottom and you will see the tooltip on bottom. This way you can make it on top and left. Now let's navigate to our style area. First, let me add an icon here and then move on style. Content width. You can define the width of your container area of tooltip. Then let's navigate to the background color section. Background color by default white, but you can set your desired background color. Uh, I prefer white for this area. And then text color. The normal color is blue and the hover color is black let me increase the font size first then you can realize the normal and hover font color changes go to typography then size type 60 and now you can see the icon increased its size and when i hover you can see it's black let's change the black color to red and you can see it's red by this way you can stylize your general style and then let's navigate to the tooltip styles and tooltip width the width you can define the width 200 pixel let's increase this and now you can see the content increased its width and tooltip background color let's change it to black and you can see the changes then text color background type typography you can increase the typography uh, 28 pixel and you can see how it's increased its typo and this is the arrow color you see there is a little arrow having a blue color you can change its color too uh, i think i should make it red okay and you see the changes of icon then arrow and then content tooltip content and tooltip background by this way you can customize any type of tooltip and arrange a perfect tooltip on your web page 
Make sure to download, install and active master add-ons from our official website or our WordPress plugin repo page. Otherwise, you can't work with our extensions and elements.